The Yankees spoke about reaching rock bottom when they concluded their three-game series in Anaheim, promising that their next nine innings would be a much cleaner product. Well, mission accomplished, at least for one night. The Yankees outlasting the Kansas City Royals tonight here at Yankee Stadium by a final of 5-4. to four. It's the Billy McKinney game. McKinney hit a three-run homer and made two terrific catches in the outfield. Glaber Torres and Franchi Cordero also going deep for the Bombers. And look, you, know, you can only win the games against the teams that you are playing. So, uh, given that, this was a great matchup for the Yankees here. You're facing a Royals team that is in dead last place in the American League Central. They're on pace for 116 losses this year. That's basically Oakland territory. Uh, this is a bad Royals team in, uh, playing out the string of a bad season. But it seemed like it might be just the kind of team that could upset the Yankees here, especially coming off their 1-5 and five road trip, of course, to Denver and the Angels. Well, McKinney did a nice job of keeping some runs off the board early, made a nice sliding grab out in the left center field gap behind Clark Schmidt, then climbed the right field wall. I don't think he took away a home run, but he definitely took away an extra base hit, a leaping grab in right center field. That one with Wandy Peralta on the mound later in the game. And, of course, the three-run homer, which put the Yanks back in the game after Clark Schmidt gave up a three-run homer early. So Schmidt hangs in there for five and two-thirds innings. He gets the W. He was actually the Yankees winning pitcher in their last victory. You got to go all the way back to Saturday in Colorado, which feels like it was like 20 years ago. Uh, but the Yankees finally get back in the win column, snapping their four-game skid here tonight against Kansas City. And McKinney, uh, a lot of talk about him post-game here in that he has done a really nice job here. And he says it's been a whirlwind of a season. Hasn't been his first crazy season. You know, he's bounced around to a bunch of different organizations. But to come back here to the Yankees, the place where uh, he obviously got called up, made his Major League debut all the way back in 2018, and never got to play a home game, uh, believe it or not. They, they played a road series that year, and then McKinney was gone soon after that and uh, on his way to Toronto. So McKinney actually never got to wear the pinstripes here at Yankee Stadium until this year, and it's done a nice job filling in. And so what does the future hold for McKinney? You know, Aaron Boone basically said, we'll see. Uh, obviously, there's a lot of talent coming back here, not only Aaron Judge, who is continuing to rehab and uh, could be moving closer. The latest update on Judge, if you missed it earlier, is that he will – uh, take live at bats on Sunday against Jonathan Lewisaga here at the stadium. So we will make sure to tune in for that because that's the first time he's faced pitching since June 3rd. Anything more than a batting practice toss. So that will be a big step for Judge. And what's next after that? I don't know. And because Aaron Boone says they don't know. And uh, will he play in minor league rehab games? I find it hard to believe that he won't, but they haven't committed to that yet. Uh, Boone saying today that there is a possibility they may just do it in simulated action. I personally don't love that idea because you remember Giancarlo Stanton played in just one minor league rehab game. They rushed him back and it took him a long time to find his timing. Now, obviously, Judge and Stanton are different players, but there's a lot of similarities there, too. So if I'm the Yankees, I would like to see Judge at least play two or three games in the minor leagues to try and get his time and get the flow of game action, especially if he's going to play any defense when he does come back. And that's something that Boone said that uh, they want him to do. Maybe he'll be mostly a DH, but uh, they do want him to be able to play some outfield. So I lost my train of thought. What was it? We, we got off the Judge train here. Billy McKinney. So where does he fit in at, with Judge coming back, with Jake Bowers coming back, with uh, Willie Calhoun coming back. you got a lot of players coming up, and so we'll see. But he did say that McKinney has earned a spot to merit consideration either on the in the lineup or on the bench, on the roster somewhere. So uh, Billy McKinney with a nice game. The Yankees with a bounce-back game. Now they got to try and make it two in a row. Yankees and the Royals coming up here at the stadium tomorrow afternoon. That's the Hokey Pokey. That's what it's all about. From Yankee Stadium, your final score once again is the Yankees 5 and the Royals 4. See ya.